Hey guys, it's Wednesday, so come with me. Let's go. I just finished filming my new video. It's going to be called The Splinter or something like that. Uh, I don't know if uh, it'll be up today or Friday because I have two videos that I want to put up. Orange juice! <laughs> Yummy. We're going to go outside because it's freaking nice out. <laughs> um, so yeah. It's a pretty funny video. It's a story, though. I haven't told you guys a story in a while, so I decided that a story would be a good idea. So I did that. Uh, also, I hit 600 subs not too long ago, and that's freaking crazy. 600 subscribers? I never thought that would happen. 600 of you guys? Are you, are you insane? That's just crazy, like... I didn't think I would ever hit 600. I don't know. At least not this soon. I mean, there must be some of you that actually think I'm funny, so that's crazy. Uh, so that, that kind of made my day a little bit, just seeing that. I just hope that uh, a lot of my subs don't leave me, you know, later on, because uh, I'm doing a lot of... I'm doing some... Uh, some competitions on my gaming channel, my old gaming channel, some giveaway stuff, and I told them that they need to be subbed to my channel to win, so I hope I don't just have a lot of fake subs, but, you know, besides that, I know that some of you are loyal to me, and I know some of you in particular that comment on my stuff all the time, and I love you guys, you guys are awesome. It just makes me feel so good inside my body areas. <laughs> It's really nice out. This is like the first day of like real nice weather in New England. There's like, in New England, there's literally maybe a week in the entire year that's like this, where the entire day is just so nice that if you miss it, then shame on you. <laughs> you know, usually I stay inside and edit videos and stuff or... Or, uh, I don't know, play video games, do stuff that I think is, I do fun things that, that uh, don't require you to be outside. I think many things nowadays. Oh my god. You hear that crow? That's crazy. Ah, ah! <laughs> oh, it's so nice out. But like I was saying, many things require you to be inside for you to have fun. Well, most things that I do, anyway. Like, uh, watching shows, or playing games, stuff like that. I watched this video on Facebook today, and it was about this homeless guy who, uh, it was called, um, I'm not a hobo, I'm a human being. Something like that. I'll post it on, the, on my fan page so you guys can see it if you want. Go to my Facebook. Uh, links in the description. Um, it's really touching. Like this, he's a... Uh, it's just this guy who who really just is down on his luck and he, he uh, he's trying to get money so he can so he can uh, pay for shelter, you know, because the winter is really tough on homeless people, and, uh, and he says that it's really, it's really tough getting money, because being a panhandler, that's what they call the people that have cups and shake them, and they're like, oh, please give me money, but, uh, apparently, he said that being a panhandler is really humiliating, and, uh, and he knows that, that most people think that Panhandlers are just people that are just trying to fake people into thinking that they're poor. But a lot of them really are. Like, a lot of them really do have just shit lives, and it sucks, you know? And uh, he, he was talking about how a lot of people come up to him and they're like, Oh, fuck you, hobo. Or, uh, or um, you know, get a job, stupid bum. Stuff like, stuff like that. And he says... 
uh, no matter what people say, he's always trying to be positive because every once in a while, someone will have a bad day and uh, they'll just say something that they don't mean. And if, if a bum, I don't want to call him a bum, but if someone like that knows about that kind of thing, then people who are in a more fortunate spot in life, like myself, should should really, like, appreciate the stuff that we have, you know? At least that's, that's what I think. But yeah, you guys should definitely watch it. It's, it's, uh, it's just good to be informed about that kind of thing. Oh, and I also saw this video of, of this woman who, who does the same thing with a cup, like panhandler, and she, she uses crutches. But she's just a normal girl, right? She just, this is what she does for a job. She, she fakes, like, being disabled with crutches that she uses for her arms, as if she can't really walk all that well. But she can, you know? She's, she's just a normal girl. But she, she uses people's emotions against them and uh, makes them give her money. Just, and apparently it works really well because she, she, uh, she spots out a street that is mainly like really high-end shopping, like Gucci and uh, Dolce Gabbana. Gabbana? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know uh, expensive stores all that well, but yeah, she she targets that street, the the rich people street, where people normally have extra money after they buy like really expensive stuff. And she gets tons of money this way, and at the at the end of the, of the day, she goes down the next street, and a van comes and picks her up, and leaves, and uh, and she just gets out of the van without the crutches, and she has normal clothes on, you know, just like a regular regular girl. And I was just like, oh, that little bitch, you know, how. Oh my god! It's made me so angry, like... How can you take advantage of the world like that? I mean, I guess a lot of people take advantage of the world, but... But in that, just... I mean, that was just... I mean, bravo to you for thinking about it, and being able to do it, and make people believe that you're in that kind of situation when you're not, but... Also, fuck you! <laughs> for... For, uh putting other people in that situation that are actually in that situation down because now people that know about you are never going to feel the same way about hobos and stuff like that. All right. I've been talking for too long. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. What is tomorrow? Thursday? All right. Thursday. Yeah. All right. So I'll talk to you on Thursday.